Well, okay, so I'm taking the quarterback out of these needs because um, that's already just a done deal that Caleb's going to be there and all that. So, uh, look, they, they, if we're going to do three, uh, at, at the top of the list, well, here, three, two, one, it's they're all big needs. We're talking about receiver, we're talking about offensive line, we're talking about defensive line. So you can really quibble on how you want to order these. But I will, I will say that um, the offensive line – is a bigger need than the defensive line because they do have Montez Sweat, a premium guy, versus who is the premium guy on the Bears' offensive line. You can argue Darnell Wright, which uh, is a fair argument, but again, he hasn't quite gotten to all-pro status yet. Uh, are you satisfied with Braxton Jones at left tackle? Um, I, I am, but there's a lot of people who are looking at Joe Alt as a guy that if he's there, would the Bears take a left tackle? The bigger concern is on the interior you're trading for a guy in Ryan Bates from Buffalo to play center for you. Eh, I'm not super excited about that. Will Tevin Jenkins stay healthy at left guard? Is Nate Davis going to play a whole lot better at right guard? So I think it's enough up front, but it it, it doesn't, you know, it it's, it's, does feel kind of band-aid-y a little bit. Like the, the premium long-term guys are not necessarily there. If Tevin stays healthy, he will be that, but he's never been able to do that. Um, defensive line, you got Montez Sweat, premium dude. Uh, change the defense when he got here, but who are you pairing with? Which is why a lot of Bears fans are hired, excited about guys like Jared Verse, Dallas Turner, etc. Um, those are real needs. And then the other is receiver. Uh, you know, you went and traded for Keenan Allen, which was unexpected and something the Bears are super excited about, as they should be, getting a experienced guy who should make the Caleb Will- Williams landing a lot easier. But who's the three, and who's more importantly, almost sort of the long-term guy, because Keenan's 32. And so how long is he going to be there? The Bears have said they want to extend it, but they still need another guy.